All right, now we introduced the notion of full and empty edges. An edge is full when the flow on the edge is equal to the capacity of the edge. An edge is empty when the flow on the edge is zero. Now we're going to be changing the flow. We're going to be changing the values on edges. So an edge could be empty and then you put flow on it and it's no longer empty. It could be not full but then you increase the flow on the edge and you might make it full. Later you might take some of that flow away and it will go back. You might take it all back. It might become empty. Question. Yeah, you you could do that, and and you would just throw it away because it it would never enter into your computation. Uh, an edge which has capacity zero is like a broken pipe. Don't use it. You can't use it. So just take it out of the problem. It doesn't play any role whatsoever. Now, uh, a little bit more subtle is. What happens if you have a network where uh, there will be breakages and there will be repairs and you're doing flows on a daily basis? So some days a link is present with a certain capacity and then something happens and it's not there. Well, it's easy. You just make trivial modifications in your data set and resolve the problem from scratch for the network of the day. Because the, the, these solutions are computationally very, very easy. Uh, if you were paying $10 million to solve it each time, then that would be different. <laughs>